So today we're going to talk about the effects of uh, reservoir depletion, and when I say effects, I mean basically stress changes. Uh, you know, the, the whole course we've basically been focused on stress. That's not going to change. So um, we're going to look at the how stress would change with reservoir depletion, and this is a sort of just a cartoon view uh, of a reservoir, and, and there's quite a few assumptions here in order to make this plot, but uh, the first one being that the horizontal stresses are equal, um, and then such that you have a reservoir that's being depleted uh, embedded into an otherwise homogeneous earth, and with that depletion you can see uh, basically how the stress changes in terms of, so these minus three, this would be, um, you know, sort of with, with depletion, you'd get uh, a, a three times amp amplification of the compressive stress in this region and this region, and that would sort of promote uh, in the center, norm, uh, reverse faulting rather, and normal faulting in the... Um, in the uh, sides, and so th this figure was taken from a paper uh, done in the 80s, and uh, you can look at the location of the book to get the paper if you want to see more details about this, but this is sort of just a cartoon view, uh, uh, and I think it's probably pretty intuitive that, you know, if we deplete the reservoir that you're going to see stress changes. 